communication the human connection is the key to personal and career success this is our today's theme and topic welcome i am dr kamran yusuf santu from the research incubation for sustainable development in today's video you will learn how to improve communication skills for career growth this is professional skill series communication works for those who work at it john paul who will work hard to learn and to improve communication he will survive otherwise there are challenges why communication skill is important at workplace there are certain factors first one is personal or professional so in our daily life development of personal or professional relationships are not possible without effective communication and you want to develop strong relationship with your family friends peers employees there is a need to enhance your communication skills effectively to build and establish such relationships number 2 point is team communication in your professional life team communication is very much important to master good communication is an essential tool in achieving productivity and performance to achieve productivity and to maintain the better working relationship it is actually required at all level of an organization and good communication is key to success this concept got more importance during covid 19 employers who want to build trust within the organizations are recommended to communicate clear message between players between their team members eventually they will get high performance and high morale a person with good communication skills will become an asset for an organization so if there is a poor communication obviously you will find unmotivated staff next point is what required at workplace so how we can improve our effectiveness how can we improve our growth or career so there are five points so number one is team building then everyone with a voice innovation growth strong management so i will explain one by one question is how can we improve all these five areas first one is goals and expectations building successful teams really means communicating and cooperating together with team members in short goals and expectations should be achievable if you will give such kind of goals which are not achievable so there will be depression among employees and their performance will go down next point is clear message means no confusion as i stated above employee satisfaction will depend a great deal on their voice and listening regardless of whether they have an idea or a complaint all should be able to communicate easily with their bosses colleagues supervisors regardless of their rank message should be clear there should be no confusion and you have to listen or employ an employee must improve herself or himself so as to explain in front of employer what they want medium there are different mediums available like email face to face conversation telephone messaging so many things here you have to select the best medium which will give the exact direction to your team player or team members so if you are not selecting a medium which is best suitable then you will find different challenges or gaps within a working environment next point is keep everyone involved means you have to open all the communication lines all the communication channels everybody should be able to speak out so this will give you innovativeness a person if he don't have any kind of fear so he will explain freely he will tell you the real picture freely this thing will lead towards innovation and creativity you have to set communication channels in a way that are acceptable to your fellow employees empathy promote dialogue so if somebody is in problem you have to show him empathy that organization is with you and he must realize that organization's commitment will support him in his problematic time that time can be within the organization or outside the organization so whatever the situation company should stand with the employee by listening his voice 
Finally, this quotation is very interesting and uh, one point which I have highlighted read that is different. So let me speak it out. To effectively communicate, we must realize that we are all different. Means the different backgrounds in the way we perceive the word and we see the word differently and use this understanding as a guide to over communication with others and whatever we have perceived we will put in our mind we will draw some sketch and will speak so a wise person a strong manager uh, if he is capable enough to understand a person's background and he can guess what he can speak and what he wants actually he can be a good manager and can lead the team. My message is improve communication skills for faster career growth. Otherwise, you may face downward trend in your life. Thank you very much. This short video will give you good information. Thank you very much. If you have any question, you can contact me. Best of luck.